Uh, well, either way, here we are for another, another little bit of magnet fishing out here on the Detroit River. It's a new, brand new spot for me. I've never magnet fished this far down. What we got here is the Ambassador Bridge connecting Windsor to Detroit. We got Mike out here with us today. And we had two of his young'uns out here with us. Well, we're gonna get the magnets in the water. GoPro snap down. See what we can find. All right. I'm starting off with one of my smaller magnets. I'm not sure what this area is like. So, just throw it in and see what we might be able to find. A little bit of a breeze. Bottom feels pretty smooth. Might have to put the bigger boys out here. See what we can find. Well, got my first find. A piece of rebar. Nice little piece of rebar out of the water. Mike and the kids are down here getting their magnets going. Oh, I put on something here. Let's see what it might be. Got some weight to it. Yeah, uh -huh. here we go. Oh. Nice, nice piece of steel bar. Good stuff. Hey, you got a nut. And a bit of gobbledygook. Let's see if we can get you unstuck here. Nope, you're not stuck. Nope, let's see what you got on here. I don't know, it feels like it might be some weed on there. Like you say, it could be just a seaweed. Yep. So this side isn't too rocky. This side, no, like I said, from this railing. Yeah. Right, right. right. Okay, I'm gonna put the Artemis to work. Let's get her, buddy. Now that I've felt out the terrain, I can trust it that I'm not going to get caught on rocks. Put the big boy to work. Well, the bigger, the bigger boy. Nice day. It's about uh, not quite 60 degrees. Sun shining, a bit of a breeze. Hopefully the audio is good. Might have to switch over to the other side and see if I can pull anything out of there. I've got a couple of small things out of this side. 
piece of rebar and the steel bar. But they're saying there could be some juicy stuff on this side. Well, I, maybe I just hooked onto a piece of juicy stuff because got some weight here. There we go. Another steel bar. Good stuff. Let's keep her going. Oh, well, got something more on here. Uh, got a lot of weight on this one. Woohoo! Don't fall off. A few more tosses here, then I'm going to go to the other side and try my luck there. Just pulling up all the junk out of the water. On the other side now, let's see if uh, we can get anything over here. I got something out of here. Don't know if it's seaweed or actually hooked onto something down there. Oh. Actually, I got it. <laughs> I got your magnets. <laughs> okay. Hang on. Want me to throw it out there for you? I got her what her magnet. Um, just <laughs> I think I got something else on here. Maybe not. Whatever it was slipped off. Yeah. 
what we got here. Small piece of steel. Piece of rebar. And a bit of gobbledygook. Oh, got some weight on this one. Oh. Yeah, let's weight it down with. Seaweed. Oh. And you got a bridge bolt. A broken bridge bolt. Cool. A bridge bolt. Oh. Okay. Ready to give the Titan a go. See what we can find. Make sure everything's tight. Off we go. A bit heavier than the Artemis. That means it's going to pick up more stuff. I think I just hooked onto something as I'm floating by. We'll see what this might be. Okay. Maybe part of a car, maybe part of a car exhaust, part of the stringer, screw, and some gobbledy go. Oh. And, oh. and we got ourselves a friendly. Yeah, send him home. Nothing to do with it. All right. Let's go. Say goodbye. 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 Uh, well, I think we might have something else on here. Yep. A long bolt. And a whole pile. I'm gobbled to you. Oh, she was in the mud. What is that? That's a pipe. Another steel pipe? Awesome job. We're starting to get some decent sized stuff out of here. Oh, yeah. That is the oldest lock of my phone. Wow. That is an old lock. Cool. I just found a quarter. Nice. Oh. That'd be that's oh. a, that'll be a nice one to clean up. Do you clean them up? Clean a lot of small stuff. Some pieces I'm not exactly sure what they are. Gobbledygook and whatnot. Yeah, I might find a whole pile of chain pieces and oh, a fishing reel's got to be down there. Yeah, there's a part off a reel. Lots of broken chain or rusted chains and screws. Awesome. Feels like got some more weight on here. Could be more seaweed though. I don't know that current must have switched and started bringing all this stuff back in. Oh, we got a bolt. It's 
It's really small stuff. Oh, nice. Nice piece of broken lure. Cool. He's trying to get back in the water. Hey, another a bridge bolt. Oh my god. He almost pinched me. He pinched me one, once already. Another little friendly. How old do you think this is? Uh, about like seven years old. Oh, that's, old. that's old. Look at him. He's Hey, we should put him back in the water, eh? Yeah, my dad said we should keep him. Though. No, you can put him back in the water. A couple more, a couple more pieces off that bridge. And some smaller metal. And some gold here. Mike's got something on here. It's coming up. Maybe it's a car. Maybe it's a motorcycle. Maybe it's Jimmy Hoffa. Oh. <laughs> oh. Okay, I guess I should give him a hand with this. Okay. Okay. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> Holy shit, look at the length of this thing. Okay. Woo. <laughs> oh my goodness. And then still in the water. Wow. What is this? <laughs> oh man. We're gonna have to drag it to the beach, I think. Okay. Just want you to have a look. We're eight feet from the water and the end of that's still in the water. The Artemis is holding it for us. Artemis is, is holding it onto the the railing. What an amazing! And this was pulled up by the 24 hound, 24 pound Artemis. Right, even the geese are honking about it. We're gonna get this get this thing out of the water and. See exactly how long it is. No wonder I think it was so heavy. It was full of water. We got a mud puppy. Mom's been wanting one of these. He's okay. coming out. Here he comes. Grab the bucket. Yeah, right here. There he is. Say hello. Is that a mud puppy or a catfish? Mud puppy. Yes, it is. I love my puppy. Is it like a oh, watch out, watch out, watch out. We have fish. Ooh. No. Like a type of fish? It's a mud puppy. It's an axolotl. It's an axolotl? I have no clue what this is. Okay, hang on for a second. Why is that, Mike? Wow, I got a complete soaker. <laughs> oh, really? Hold on. All right. Is this a lamp post? I'm not sure. It is some kind of a post that something could attach. If something else was attached to before. It's a lamp post, right? Hold 
That ain't going nowhere. His giant, his giant poop. <laughs> well, Rick, you cannot bring this home. Nope. So let's get a freaking picture, dude. <coughs> I'm so. That's what I want to see. That's like sticks and Watch. Woo, that's aluminum. Nice. You know how much that's. Do you know how much that aluminum's worth? How much? Crazy, it's worth about a buck twenty-five a pound. Really? This sucks. It's so big. I know. Well, it's been quite an eventful afternoon. We got a, we got a lot of stuff, a lot of bridge bolts and bridge rivets, uh, rebar pipes, pieces of exhaust, uh, bolts, nuts, cable. We had a couple of friendlies that we had to. Turn back into the wild, into the wild, and of course that light post. That thing was in the mud. It took all that the two of us could muster to get it out of the water. But it's worth it. So we get this stuff packed up, get back to the car, and see you in a minute. All right, that's gonna. Wrap it up for today. Uh, once again, we've been down here by, by the Ambassador Bridge. Didn't get uh, anything really shocking. But yeah, we did. We got that that light pole that Mike pulled up. Again, I like to thank Mike for coming out. We enjoy any time we, we get him out. And uh, hopefully next day or two we'll get him and Scott both out here and uh, once again I want to thank all the magnet fishers all around the world. Let me turn this way so I get the sun so you're not getting a, just a black picture of me. Uh, all the magnet fishers around the world thank you for what you do. We are making a difference. Make sure you tell your friends and family anybody you see on the street about this wonderful hobby. Uh, if you like this video, subscribe, hit that thumbs up button, share it, leave a comment. If you're interested in getting a magnet or any accessories, check the link down below for Kratos Magnetics. Great company, great products, incredible customer service. The only magnets I'll use. So, on that note, I'm going to shut it down and say, just remember, the best personality is a magnetic personality. See you next time.